Hello, beautiful people. It's a Choose Tuesday, and today I want you to choose to not complain and choose to thank God for his goodness. First Chronicles 16 and 34 says, Give thanks to the Lord, for he is good. His love endures forever. Now, aren't you glad that we can freely give thanks to the Lord for all that he has done and is doing in our lives? Aren't you glad about that? God is good, not just to me, but to you as well. We don't deserve the love that he gives us, but he still loves us unconditionally. We ourselves, we put conditions on our love for others, or our love for our family, or our love for our friends, and towards one another, but not God. Think about it. Think about this. Think about your life. Your life may not be perfect right now, but at least you have life. So many people didn't make it to see today. Your home may not be a mansion or as big as you want it right now, but at least you're not homeless and on the streets begging for food or begging for money and nowhere to lay your head at night. Think about that. You may not even be making those six figures on the job that you have in your mind and that you should be making. But at least, guess what? You're not in that unemployment line. So I could go on and on and on about how blessed you truly are, how blessed we truly are. God is so good. He's amazing. And it says that his love endures forever, which means he is not going to get tired of loving on you today just because you may have failed the test. You may have messed up or failed that test that he gave you today or yesterday, or you might have even slipped into temptation. Regardless of how it may seem, look around you. That's what I want you to do today. Look around you. I mean, really, really take a break and look around and make a list of all of the things, no matter how big or no matter how small God is doing or has done for you in your life right now. Today, I challenge you to spend time giving God thanks. Doesn't cost a thing to say thank you. Thank him for his plan for your life, the plan that he has over your life. Thank him for rescuing you from that sin, the sin you might have been thinking about a few minutes ago. Thank you for, thank him for rescuing him, you from that sin, for his love that never gave up on you. Thank him for that, even when you gave up on yourself. Mm. Just tell God thanks for all of the but God moments. <laughs> I know you have plenty of those. The could have beens, the should have beens, <laughs> but He stepped in and blocked those moments. Tell God today, thanks. Tell him thanks for his love. Tell him thanks for his goodness that never fails. He deserves our praise. Don't you think so? So I need you right now to look up, smile, and tell God thank you. All right, beautiful people, I want you to be blessed. I want you to be a blessing to others. Be the best you. Love on yourself today. Do something to grow yourself. And remember, every day is not going to be perfect. Not at all. But it can be positive on purpose. So be intentional about finding the positive in your today. I want you to have a purposefully positive Choose Tuesday. And hey, keep going. You've got this. And God has you covered.